Taurus, Gemini. Cleansing the decks of any and all negative energies. Only being the appearance what is not. Big Silver's reading. We can be advised. Oh, I'm getting sleepy. I'll take my kiddo and uh, to the, her dentist tomorrow. She got to check up. I need to go to bed. I've been working all day, you guys. <laughs> I seriously love my job, bro. Like, I could literally do it in my sleep if Abba would let me. But, you know. Um, Abba says I have to rest, so. Anyways. Cleansing the decks of any and all negative energy. All the beings of the purest white as that. Me still this reading and give me advice. Still this reading now in Yeshua's name. Amen and amen. A whole and so it is. Therefore, let it be written. Therefore, let it be done. Taurus Gemini, what does your person think about you? We're just going to get like one and a couple from there. Taurus Gemini, what does your person think about you? Well, they're thinking they want to talk and they want to tell the truth, which is always a good thing. What else? They also may be thinking about you may um your person may be a Libra. Uh they think they need to strongly protect you. Okay. And protect um, this conversation that y'all are going to have, I'm getting, they want to overcome all challenges, okay, um, a hawk, a walrus, or a bear, maybe significant, or a puma, for either you or your person. It may be animal spirit guides of you guys. A cougar. This person is watching you. They're spying on you all the time. If you're posting anything, they're watching it. If you're not on social media, they're driving by your house. Or they have someone watching you and then feeding them information. Or they're spying on you through tarot cards. Through, like, readings and stuff. They're getting... They're somehow... They're spying on you, bro. Okay. Um, but this is, like, looking at you with a set of eyes, so... Um... They got somebody watching you if they're not doing it themselves. They're jelly. They're daydreaming. And they're also wanting to give you a big cup of love. But they're coming as a knight. They aren't coming to you as a king there with that cup of love. Oh, okay. Maybe they don't want to be your Romeo. Or they don't want to fear their Romeo. Let's see. Yeah, they're fighting. They're fighting fear and fighting their Romeo side. You know, the the seducer, the side that wants to flirt and be in and out. And oh, there's a king. There he is. Look. He comes in all my readings. Well, hello, sir. How would you like to introduce yourself today? Huh? 
<laughs> you can't be Captain Hook today. No, you're Mr. Walrus. No, Beaver. Mr. Beaver. From the Chronicles of Narnia, Mr. Beaver. I love that movie, you guys. Um, sorry. <laughs> the King of Cups comes out in every single one of my readings. It seems like no matter what deck I'm using. Look, tower at the bottom of the deck. You know what? I may have read the Aries Taurus wrong. The Scorpio may just intrude on you and your person's life. That could be what that tower is. I may just be like, boom, drop them. Hey, how are you? <laughs> That'd be hilarious. Um, let's see. I did see a page of cups, so they might want to apologize. They're not telling you how much they love you. Yeah, they're fighting these other choices. They're fighting confusion. They're fighting, they're just fighting like dark energy. All right, what do they plan to do about it? They got a lot of love for you that they're like not telling you about, okay? They hold it back. But see this beaver, he's swimming in the ocean. And water is emotion in the tarot. Um, three of Wands. Okay, so they're waiting. Or they're rapidly growing. They're, they're waiting and rapidly growing because they're doing a lot of inner work I'm getting on themselves. Um... They're also defensive against any third parties, and they're fighting third parties. They want to send you a message. About how they want you back in their life. They want you back. If I could turn back time. If I could find a way. And you could be dealing with a Taurus, a Virgo, or a Capricorn. They want a new beginning. And they don't want to wait, and they don't want you to go. Please don't go. Okay. No in reverse. Okay. So y'all take that how you want. You make me so happy. I want to drown you in luxury and spoil you rotten. You deserve it, Earth Angel. I wish my children or want our children to be from the two of us. Or I wish our children, my, our children. Y'all know what I mean. If you already have kids, this person kind of wishes it had been with you guys instead of whoever they were with because it is broken, you know. All right, it says, you could easily play games with me and break my heart. My achy, breaky heart. <laughs> I just heard that, sunky, that country song. You, my achy, breaky heart, Billy Ray Cyrus. So that means something to somebody. But I know I need to work on my own thought processes because you have integrity and have only shown me truth. I'm terrified. <laughs> this person is terrified of love. And just like they probably hyperventilate at the idea of being in a relationship but they freaking love you bro for real um I know you're an earth angel so whoever's watching is an earth angel because I've gotten two cards of it already I'm surprised the temperance card didn't come out I know you're an earth angel it's standing in your power I'm deep in thought 
Sorry guys, about what you said, I'm daydreaming about proposing to you and what it would be like to live with you. I plan to protect this, you, and us at all costs. Ooh. Okay. There you go, Taurus Gemini. Get it, get it, bout it, bout it, baby. Get you some sugar dugga wooga booga. You can tell I'm tired when I start making up words. <laughs> I love you guys. Like, comment, and subscribe.